inequality between the states. What is freedom of religion? It's the freedom to practice any religion or no religion. Freedom of religion is the first freedom listed in the First Amendment, and no wonder. There was a long history of wars fought in the name of religion. In the Holy Land, Christians and Muslims had fought each other for centuries. In Europe, Catholics fought Protestants, and the Spanish Inquisition condemned heretics. The Mayflower brought refugees from Europe's religious strife to Massachusetts, the Pilgrims. Then, neighboring Connecticut and Rhode Island were settled by religious refugees fleeing from Massachusetts. Pennsylvania was settled by religious refugees, the Quakers. South Carolina was partly settled by French Protestants fleeing Catholic persecution. The Founding Fathers took the lesson of history. So they embedded in the Constitution the right to worship or not to worship. For proof of their wisdom, look around. In much of the world, fanatics still commit violence in the name of religion, but rarely in America. The Constitution also provides that the federal government may not establish an official religion. Again, the lesson of history shows that when a government adopts one religion, it suppresses the others, and bloodshed follows. That's why you can't be forced to pray in a government school. But the flip side is neither can the government school bar them from praying on their own time, at lunch or at an after-school religious club. Sure, Americans still argue over the limits on freedom of religion and on freedom from religion, but we settle those arguments in court. What is freedom of religion? You can practice any religion or not practice a religion.